The danger's in the knife. You focus on the knife, you take your eye off the ball. Okay, absolutely spot on. Let's just see whether that happens, okay? Grab so, the finance ball and he goes, Finance is the engine of the business! Cash flow is what makes the business go around with finance is absolutely nothing. When I spend money, I spend my own money. I spend my own hard-earned money. All of us. See what's going on in the outside world. The outside world will get you. And really great businesses are really obsessed with what's going on in the outside world, strategy. So strategy is, where am I now? Where am I going? How am I going to get there? Strategy is about, it's impossible to plan where I'm going from where I am now, because right now my brain is full of everything. Ladies and gentlemen, Robert Craven. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Thank you very much. It's uh, wonderful to be here and it's certainly a thrill. What's that from? It's a 20 pound bet between me and all of you that I can get through the whole of this morning without using any business school nonsense phrases like target market segmentation or business process reorganization. We're in a world where everything is similar. We have comp competitors who sell similar products at similar prices, employing similar people with similar qualifications, using similar computers. So why on earth should people bother to buy from you when they can buy from the competition? Finance is a consequence of how good you are at selling marketing and how good you are at operations. Sack 20, 30, 40, 50 percent of your customers. So running a business is like keeping all the balls in the air. So it kind of goes sell, make, collect, sell, make, collect. And if you drop the balls, you're out of business. Finance is really, rather than juggling with a ball, Finance is uh, more like juggling with one of these. And you notice the body language on this table has changed very fractionally. <laughs> All the guys have just gone like this. The danger's in the knife. You focus on the knife, you take your eye off the balls. Okay, absolutely spot on. Let's just see whether that happens, okay? So, the other thing, the other thing I must mention to you, especially you, is I walk forwards when I juggle. But I've had, this great, I've had this really great idea, which it's never worked before, but today feels good, that what we could do is we could blindfold me, like that, and we could put the ball on your head, wherever it is, and see what happens. Right, okay. Sell, make, collect. Let's see what happens, see whether we can do it. Okay. Sell, make, collect. Sell, make, collect. Okay. Are there any web designing type people in here? Search engine optimization people? Ah, scum of the earth they are. Um, <laughs> Did I think that or did I say it? Okay. I look her in the eye. Look in the eye, not round the eye. <laughs> Philippa. <laughs> Philippa, in case you're under, under any illusion about why I'm here today, the reason I'm here today is uh, because we really value doing this piece of work with you. We really feel that working together would be great. We really feel that you're just the type of business we'd like to work with right now. And I just wanted to come here today to make that absolutely clear to you that you understood how enthusiastic and excited we are about the idea of working with you. Have I made myself clear? Crystal. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Look into my eyes, not round my eyes. Perfect. I think that if we all of us focused all our positive karma and energy on that candle and we really concentrated on it hard and we imagined it blowing out, that I reckon the candle would just, under the, the weight the weight of all that good karma and good vibes, I'm being serious, don't look at me like that. <laughs> the weight of karma and vibe that the candle would just blow out. You see, even now it's trying to go out. You can see that, it's, it's, it's really making a bid to go out. So I want all of you with me, I'll count down from five to zero. By the time I get to zero, the candle will just blow out because of the, the positive energy. So five, look at the candle, imagine it blowing out. Four, you can really see it going out. Three, it's definitely going to blow out. If we put a bit more positive energy on it, the candle will really go out. Two, we're going to go for it. And one, and... And even with her coughing, <laughs> the candle wouldn't blow out. And you actually thought the candle would blow out. And the thing is, of course the candle won't blow out. It doesn't matter how much strategizing and how much planning and how many ideas and how many dreams and how many people you talk to, the candle still won't go out. The candle will only go out if you do one thing and one thing only, and that thing is take action. Thank you very much.